Hola, hello everyone. I'm Sonia de los Santos. Welcome to En Casa con Sonia. And uh, we are recording this special concert episode because our good friends at Lincoln Center reached out to us. And um, Lincoln Center is a, a venue, a place we have performed at uh, a lot over the years. And it's one of my favorite places in New York City. Uh, so we are dedicating these songs to them, to the folks there, and to all of the families who are watching from home, uh, Lincoln Center from home. <laughs> so uh, for those of you who don't know me, uh, I'm Sonia, and uh, I, I sing and I play music for children and families. And um, so those are the songs that I am going to be sharing with you. I am gonna sing some of the songs that I usually uh, do at my shows, and uh, but in a in a much more relaxed way <laughs> here at home. Um, and so I hope you enjoy. I'll give you some um, some hints on how to sing along to the songs, or some dance moves, and some background on the songs too. So let's start with a song I wrote called Alegría and Alegría means joy. It's the title track of our Alegría album and um, and it has a chorus where you can just repeat that one word Alegría and you'll be fine. Um, so it sounds like this. Alegría. Try it. <laughs> and now go lower. Alegría. Alegría. Good. And uh, optional, but fun to do if you want to put your hands up like this and sway from side to side. Um, that can get a lot of fun. <laughs> okay. So, Alegría.
there was alegria, song about joy, and now I want to go to um, introduce a very special instrument. Uh, what I was playing before was a guitar, right? And um, I'm not sure if you have seen one of these before. If you have been to one of our concerts, you might have seen it. This Mexican guitar is called Jarana. And uh, the Jarana comes from the south of Mexico, uh, the state of Veracruz. And I'm gonna use it to play this next song. Um, and the next song is uh, called La Golondrina. It's a song about a migrant bird, and I learned all about migrant birds. Um, uh, the first time I heard about migrant birds, I should say, uh, was when I was uh, very young. I used to visit my grandmother at her house, my abuelita, and there was um, a nest with birds in one of the corners of her house. And I'd love to just sit and, and watch uh, those birds. And one day I went back to the house and the birds were gone. So I asked about them and my grandmother explained to me that they were golondrinas, migrant birds and that migrant birds travel very long distances um, to find a better place to live. And so that stuck with me um, my whole life. And, and many, many years later, I found myself living uh, in New York City, having migrated from Mexico, where I was born and raised. And, um, and I thought, well, maybe I'm a little golondrina. So I wrote this next song. Um, and you can dance to this one, moving your arms up, and down. Arriba y abajo. Arriba, abajo. If you do it fast enough, maybe you will fly all the way to Mexico. <laughs> okay. Jarana and harmonica. Crazy combination. But here we go. <laughs>
Sandrina, the swallow, and um, now let's do let's do a song called uh, Burundanga. Burundanga, um, in the context of this song, means um, like a problem, something very complicated. But also in the song, uh, the message of the song says. Um, that with love and with understanding our brothers and sisters, we can fix many different things in the world. So uh, that's what I like this song. Uh, this song I learned from uh, a great Cuban singer named Celia Cruz. I'm sure you've heard about Celia Cruz. If you haven't, go uh, listen to her music and, this ver and, the, and her version of this song, Burundanga. Um, I don't play the same way in the same style she used to sing it. It sounds more like a Mexican song, like a wapango with the harana. Um, but uh, I love this song. And in the chorus of the song, um, there's some hand motions you could do at home. Um, I can't, I'll show them to you, but then I'm gonna go back to playing my harana, so it's on you to do them. When you hear in the chorus, Avambele, you're gonna put your hands up like this, abambele, by the way, I don't know what abambele is, I think it's just a made up word, um, practica el amor, that means practice love, so you're gonna give yourself a hug, and then tap your shoulders, defienda tu hermano porque entre hermanos se vive mejor, that's the first part, second one, abambele, practica el amor, Si somos humanos, usamos las manos con el corazón. If we're humans, let's use our hands with our hearts. And you can make a little heart. That's it. Um, and in the middle of the song, there's a spoken word part that my friend Caridad de la Luz, a.k.a. La Bruja, wrote. And I love those words, so uh, be sure to listen for those. Um, okay, Burundanga. Songo le ve a Borondongo, Borondongo le ve a Bernabé, Bernabé le pegó a Muchilanga, le echó Urundanga, le hincha en los pies.
manos con el corazón. ¡Urundanga! Ok. Um, all right, let's do a song. Um, a song written by the great American songwriter Woody Guthrie. Um, it's a song um, that has been done um, a lot, um, a lot of times, and um, and and it's a song that's important to me. And I made a version of it in Spanish, uh, but today we're gonna do a bilingual version. So there's a little bit of English and Spanish in it. Um, the song is This Land is Your Land. Um, in Spanish, Esta es tu tierra. And um, there's some special hand motions um, out there. I'll show you how I do, I do my hand motions and feel free to do your own or, um, or follow these. Um, all right, so Esta es tu tierra in the chorus. When you hear esta es tu tierra, you point away from you. Esta es tu tierra, esta es mi tierra. Then you're going to point from side to side. Desde California hasta Nueva York. Good. Um, desde las montañas a todos los mares. Esta tierra es para ti y para mí. That's it. That's how I do it. Uh, feel free to sing in English or in Spanish and do the hand motions. They work on every language. Or if you know another, another version of this song in another language. I've heard there's, um, there's a ton of versions in different languages. So I would personally love to learn more. Okay. Here we go.
for dancing. Um, I'm gonna say goodbye with a song. It's a, it's a lullaby. Uh, it's a new song I wrote uh, called Sueña and that means dream. Um, and uh, thinking about this song, uh, growing up I had many many dreams of uh, things I wanted to do in my life and um, I gotta say um, one of my biggest dreams was to be able to to sing, to sing for people of all ages, to travel doing music, uh, to sing with my friends. And I am very happy to say that that particular dream has come true. So if you've been to one of our shows or have listened to our songs, um, you're being part of that dream come true. So thank you very much. Uh, I know these are uncertain times and our mind is that many different places um, but we can still have dreams we can still think about our dreams the things that make us happy things we want in our lives to happen one day <clears throat> so this song is about dreams the chorus says sueña sueña no dejes de soñar dream dream never stop dreaming sueña tuning in. I am Sonia de los Santos. This is En Casa con Sonia. Uh, thank you Lincoln Center for the invitation uh, of recording these songs for you and I hope to see you all again very very soon. Take care, stay positive, stay healthy and uh, see you next time. Gracias. Adios. <laughs>